Former Strictly Come Dancing star and BBC journalist Kate Silverton has a new job having been inspired to make the change by her fertility struggle. Former BBC journalist Kate Silverton unexpectedly walked away from her broadcasting career in 2020 to train as a children's counsellor. The career change was inspired by her IVF journey, and she has also since worked with hundreds of families who struggled to conceive. Kate and her husband ex-Royal Marine Mike Heron underwent several unsuccessful rounds of treatment. However, in 2011, aged 40, she fell pregnant, and they welcomed their beautiful daughter Clemency Florence Rose that November. The love I feel for her is overwhelming, Kate told fans at the time. Just watching her little face and her expressions means everything to me. Just over two years later, the couple shared more wonderful news when they revealed they were expecting again. Mike and I are very happy to share that Clemency is set to become a big sister, Kate tweeted in 2013, and the following June, their son Wilbur was born. With her second parenting book soon to be published and her eldest child about to start senior school Kate, 52, has been reflecting on her fertility struggle. I learned a lot in my own journey, Kate reveals. My advice for someone going through the early stages of IVF is, first and foremost, find out if there's a reason behind the infertility. She told the mirror, take care of you, she says. Because the process of IVF takes its toll physically as well as mentally. Take control of your circumstances. Throw yourself into it and keep yourself open. I got to the point where I accepted that we weren't going to be able to have children, so we went the full journey. I understand the heartache, I really do, she confessed. One couple she has been sharing her parenting wisdom with is her former Strictly Come dancing partner. Aljash Skorjanec and his It Takes Two hostess wife Jeanette Manrara. Kate took part in the Saturday evening ratings topper in 2018 but was eliminated in week 8. She has remained in touch with Alges and Gushes. They're going to be amazing parents, absolutely. The couple announced in February that they were expecting their first child. Unlike Kate and her husband, they managed to conceive naturally. However, they have admitted they were considering IVF after they struggled to get pregnant.